Don't you open that trap door! You're a fool if you dare! Stay away from that trap door! Cause there's something down there! Ba -nam, ba -nam. Hello everyone, welcome to Go Game Yourself. I'm Jordan and I am time traveling back to a time when there were about f one, two, three, seven. Is that right? Seven. Seven colors in video games! Back to when I was a kid and I used to watch my brother play this game, The Trapdoor, based on the stop motion claymation animated kids show from the 80s. I used to watch my brother play this on a Spectrum and this is one of my earliest gaming memories. And I've decided to play it because I found a lovely little website which seems to have gotten some sort of right to use these games in an HTML5 emulator. I think it's, well, about as legit as an emulator can get, which is probably not very legit at all. So I'm going to redefine my keys here because I don't know if I can play with that control setup. And we will, we will guide Burke, yes that's the main character's name, around the big spooky house castle thing that he lives in, in order to feed his master. That's the object of this game, you have to get ingredients and create stuff and send them up to the... I'm going to be Learner Burke. And you send, you send the ingredients, once you've got them all, you send the meals up to the master, who will then go, Burke, where's my dinner? Yet again. Hello! Oh, I better not open that trap door today. Come on, Drut. Hello, Boney. So yes. Oh, there we go. There's our... Message, Burke, get me a can of worms. I can't really do an impression of the voice of the guy of, of the guy upstairs, the thing upstairs, whatever the hell it is. I don't think you ever seen him in the animated series. So I need to get a can of worms. Oh, here's here's Burke's kitchen. Burke's kitchen. Hello, I need a can of worms. I need a can first. This looks like a can. Oh, globbits, I hope this is right. Let's get the worms now from the... Oh, I'm going to have to open that trap door again. Burke actually did sound something a little like that. Oh, I love the way he just casually drops and goes, Ah, to hell with this thing. It can smash in the floor for all I care. The little yellow spider isn't completely accurate. That's Drut. He's just an annoying little cross-eyed spider and he's just not very good, really. And he will... He's eating the worms? No! Don't eat the worms, Drut. I need those. Okay, that's weird. So I've got one worm in the can. Let's get some more. Let's close this trap door before something gets out of it. So yeah, if you haven't seen... The Stop eating the worms, Drut. God damn you. You get... No. I need to get rid of that spider. Right. No, 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 no. Where'd he go? Will you stop that? So the trap door was essentially this mysterious, well not really mysterious door, it was just a, a wooden door in the floor that led down into, I guess the only way to describe it is complete and utter madness and terror. Well, for Burke anyway. This show, this show was very, very colourful. A lot more colourful than the Spectrum game, unfortunately. And I can't open the trap door. Um, and every time Burke opened the trap door, or if the trapdoor just happened to be lying open, which was often the case, bad things would come out of it. And then Burke would have to sort it out. Oh, there we go. He's picked up the can of worms. So I want to send this up to the master. And there's usually an elevator in which to do that in the game. And in the cartoon. He used to send it up in one of these elevator type things here. These food service lifts. I hope this is right. Thank you. Oh, I love the way he walks just as his arm's going, Hey, up, I'm a dodgy gee. Oh, that's it. There we go. <laughs> wow, two really horrible attempts to speak English by me there. He looks a bit fidgety. He's like some sort of weird crack addict. Oh, hang on. What's this? Okay, but I wanted more worms. <gasps> okay, but I wanted more worms! I... Oh, okay. That's possibly one of the most horrifying noises I've ever heard in my life. It sounded like someone was drilling the numbers into the screen. Burke! I want a bottle of Eyeball Crush! Ah, that's dis 
disgusting. I hate anything to do with eyeballs. I can't even watch people put contact lenses in. It creeps me the hell out. I'm just gonna climb upstairs here. Go across here to these yellow things. I would never say it like that. Red pots. Not living them. Where did it go? Oh, what's that? Are those eyeballs? Oh, am I gonna have to pick up some goopy eyeballs? Yeah, apparently I am. What am I supposed to do with these? I'm trying to time travel in my mind back to when I was a kid and what I experienced or even any screenshots of this and I remember seeing like these things coming out of these plant pots, these big stalks and they might have been eyeballs. No, that's not it. Get back here. Where is it? Where is it? Come on. Come here. Come here, yo! Oh, oh his master's not going to be happy about this. Oh, there it is. He's still here. He's behind the cauldron. I have to get him. Stand still. Hey, got you. I'm hoping that this is the correct thing. Hey, that was kind of weird. And go this way to find more eyeballs. Let's open the trap door for a bit of fun. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, crap. Crap, close the door, close the door. What is that monstrosity? It's got... Oh, that's its tail. Oh, uh oh. Uh, could you stop following me, please? Could you... Thank you. Do I need to pick up more of these things? I, I don't know. I don't know for certain. Well, uh, let's... I'm gonna go back. Because I get the feeling that this isn't right. Oh god, that big purple freak is still flying around. Oh no, no, I don't want to open the... Wow, wow. Oh, that's hilarious. I can fling things up using the trapdoor? Oh, drat, go on there. I want to hit that thing in the ass. I don't think I can hit it in the ass, though. But I remember eyeballs growing on stalks. I'm going to go back into the kitchen and I'm going to have a look around and see if there's anything that I maybe need to do. The one thing I can do is kind of like look at items because I was doing that with the glass jar or not the glass jar whatever that thing was the jar with the worms and I was it was kind of like tilting it on its side so and there is a button called tilt so I'm guessing you know there might be something there I might have to do something I haven't looked at all of the items that I can pick up and I don't know what they are what's this What's this cage thing? Oh, that's good. Oh, oh, hang on. Okay, that looks useful. Let's just, I, I still, I love his casual throwing. Oh, I don't care, I just drop it here. I should say that, I should drop it here. Oh, globbits, I made a right blooming mess. Great Grum, uh, one of the best things that Burke ever said was Great Grum Fuddock's Tufts when something went wrong. Oh, what's this I've picked up? It's like a George Foreman grill. Oh, look at that, he even has a pushing animation. Right, now, what do I want to do? I want to pick up whatever that seed packet thing was. Oh. It's seed. Can I... Oh, what the hell? No, don't pick it up. Oh, and I put it on a shelf. There's a lot of weird... The controls are a bit weird in this in that... I just seem to have to walk into things to set some things down. Let's see if I can put these eyeballs in the pot and see what happens. See if they grow. Hey! I don't know if that was the thing to do. Uh oh. Too late! I've changed my mind! No points. Uh oh. Burke! I want some fri fried eggs. Are you serious? You wanted eyeballs a second ago. Now you want fried eggs. Where am I going to get fried eggs from? Oh! Well, that's already doing something. Nice. 
Oh, look at that! An eyeball grew. Oh, dear God! Oh, what the hell? What's it doing? Big freaky eyeball plant. Uh, just you stay there. Oh, the other one's growing as well, and I seem to be stuck on the stairs. No, there we go. I just hadn't gone the whole way up. Thought that. Way and that will grow into some horrible mutant plant. I don't exactly know how to f farm them. I'm just gonna let them do their thing. I'm not sure where to. Oh, hang on a second. I've had an idea of how to get eggs. I have to get that big freaky bird thing to follow me into the room. Here it comes. Here it comes. Come this, come this way, you big giant freak. Please. I had an idea. The big weight thing in the middle of the next room, I have to maybe use that to bonk it. Yes, and that's a word that Burke uses quite a bit, actually. When he gets his rolling pin, he likes to bonk things. It, it doesn't mean what you probably think it means now, you know, what people would use it for nowadays. One thing I do need to do is, I think this is the frying pan thing that I need to pick up. So if I pick this up, I will put this on the stove. And that should get, that should at least, that's a, that's what I need to cook the eggs. And I just have to get the eggs. Come on, can I have the yellow bucket please? Oh, Globbert, I've got a yellow bucket. Where, what's in the bucket? Is there anything in the bucket? Sh oh, what, what is th what is that? What is that? It looks like an arrowhead. Pick it up. There we go. And set it down here. Now, how do I use this thing? Can I use this thing? What is that thing? I don't know what it is. I don't know what this is. Maybe if I put this in the frying pan, it will heat up and fire skyward up into that bird's tail and its ass and it'll drop an egg? Maybe? Does that sound like a plan? Look, see the bird's coming all the way over and then it goes, nope, 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 no, 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 you can't, no, no, it's no, just no. Just no. Come here, come here, trot! Oh, hang on. Interesting. I can push all of this into the next room. I'm just rearranging the downstairs part of the castle where Burke lives and dwells and works constantly. I'm running out of time. I love how the UI in this game, like for the for your time and your score, is just saying that I'm a learner. You know, you've got the L plates up, the good old driving L plates all around it just to say, you're a learner, Burke, you're not an expert. An ex Burke? Uh, no, wait, that would be a person who was formerly Burke. Oh, Drut, stay there, I want to fling you skyward. Oh, hang on, I have an idea now. Oh, I have a great idea, actually. That wasn't the idea. Oh, no, hang on, hang on, I think I solved it. Oh, I'm going to leave the trapdoor open. No, I need to close the trapdoor. Oh, and there's Drut, he's having a feed, having a wee worm. So I'm going to go and get that arrow thing and I'm going to drop it onto the trapdoor and I'm going to fire it skyward into the bird's arse. And then I, yeah, hopefully the bird will drop an egg. I've got a brilliant plan. Let's hope it works. Come on. Well done, Burke. You missed because you just didn't do it in time. There's more worms out as well. Oh, Drut will eat those. There he is. There is good old, good old Drut. Hey! Oh, hang on. I have to close it. I lost my arrow, but the bird is freaking out. Look at him. More massive eyeballs. What's the bird doing? Come on. What are you doing? Oh. Oh, oh, oh what? Oh, did I have to catch that? Oh, for the love of Taft. Oh, brilliant. Well, the master isn't happy. Berk, pull out! I've changed my. I've changed my mind. Arrow. We failed again to get a meal for the master, but at least I figured out what to do. And I think I have to put the pan on the floor, hit the bird in the ass. Oh, here we go. Berk, I want boiled slimies. What? What are boiled slime? I think I know what boiled slimies are. 
Yeah, these things are slimy, all right. And just pick one of them up. Yay, I got one. He got one. That's how you do an impression of the Ghostbusters bell and also make a really horrible noise that makes sure that no one ever watches your videos or listens to you again. Sorry about that. Let's go and drop this. Ooh! Giant eyeballs and they've all landed on the floor. Oh, was, oh I don't even like the th thought of that, of a giant eyeball falling from that height onto the floor and... oh. I really don't like stuff to do with eyeballs. It's the one, th well, there's probably a few things that I'm squeamish about if they actually happened. But the giant, but eyeballs, oh, hang on, did I miss? Oh, crap. Yeah, eyeballs are something that I'm extremely squeamish about. I really don't like it. I think part of my fear actually, not, well, yeah, not fear, but absolute disgust at anything to do with eyeballs probably goes back to I remember a scene in Alien 3 where Ripley finds Bishop and you can see like part of his eyeball his the skin on his face is kind of hanging off and flapping about in the wind and it was just horrible really didn't like that so there's probably something there that makes me really yeah, I just feel wrong. Let's move this cauldron out of the way. That wasn't a push. He kind of just danced into it. Let's see. I am rearranging everything in the mansion, in the big castle. I'm pushing it all out of... This is no longer the kitchen. This is just stuff. I have completely clogged up the place. Isn't that wonderful? Look at the mess I'm making. Yeah, this is turning into an episode of the Trapdoor all on its own, where Burke is just running around the swamp after these slimies who keep appearing and disappearing. Come on. Yay! I got one. I got one. I got a green slimy thing and I don't know where to put it. Where do I put it? Does it go in the cauldron? Maybe. The cauldron is the only place that seems to make sense to me in terms of where these things go. Like I can't put this in the glass jar. Can I? If we can pick up this green slimy we might be able to drop it in the cauldron. I don't even know if that's the right thing to do here. I'm not sure. I really don't know what the hell I'm doing. But I'm having fun. I just wish I could make a proper meal. I'm, I'm kind of sucking as, at feeding the master his dinner. I'm going to drop the glass bottle in. Or I'm going to at least try to drop the glass bottle into the cauldron. Just to see if it will go in or if it will just fall to the ground and either shatter or do nothing. Might not even be able to drop it because it knows the game knows that there isn't an available space for this item. Or I could be wrong. I don't know what to do now. Uh oh. Well, Merc, too late. I've I've changed my mind. Sorry, Richard Nixon. I'm gonna see if I can at least push this thing back into the other room. I don't even know how this works. I don't know how to operate this piece of equipment. Oh. What's what's happening? As a learner, I think you are incompetent. Oh. And there you have it, people. I suck at serving up food to the master in the castle that contains the mysterious trap door. So that has been a little travel back through time. That's a real nostalgia trip for me because I was, a, I was and still am a big fan of the animated series, which I suggest you look up if you've never heard of it or watched it. It was something else. It was very colorful and very dark and also very British. If you've enjoyed this video, hit the like button, leave some comments, 
below and also subscribe to the channel for more updates on everything that's gone on with this channel because I'm expanding out and branching out all the time and looking for loads of games to play because I love games, very passionate about them. I have been since, essentially, since seeing the trap door and other Spectrum games. That's where I started. That's my background in gaming in terms of being a fan of games. So thanks again for watching. This has been Go Game Yourself and this has been my little trip through time. I've been Jordan. Cheerio!